2022's Top 6 Most Expensive Cars. There are 7 billion people in the world, but only a handful are fortunate enough to grace the earth in the coolest and in the most expensive automobiles. These cars are so exclusive that only the wealthiest could ever lay eyes on them, let alone drive them. But fret not, because we've got you covered. Welcome to Luxco. Today, we'll be taking a look at the 6 most expensive cars in the world in 2022. But before we zoom off in these luxurious cars, please make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. Now, fasten your seatbelts and enjoy the ride. At number 6, we have the Gordon Murray T50's Nicky Lauda, which costs $4.3 million. Gordon Murray is a renowned British designer of Formula One racing cars. This particular hypercar is named after Nicky Lauda, who is a three-time Formula One champion that died in 2019. Car enthusiasts described the T50's Nicky Lauda as one of the most extreme vehicles on the planet. According to Gordon Murray, the production of this car will start by January 2023. The automaker is making just 25 units of this model, so it definitely gives a sense of exclusivity for those who will purchase it. The T50 Sneaky Lauda uses a 4.0-liter V12 and its output is boosted from the traditional 663 horsepower to an incredible 711 horsepower. This mega vehicle features a central layout and a revolutionary fan-assisted aerodynamics design. Its red, glossy exterior definitely complements its powerful features. Since the T50's Nicky Lauda is designed to be a track car, Gordon Murray replaced the right seat with a fire extinguisher system. The driver still sits in the middle and there's room for a passenger on the left. Formula One fans out there will surely look out for this car because each T50's Nicky Lauda will pay tribute to a Grand Prix win from one of Gordon Murray's Formula One cars. Each one will also include a book about that event, including Murray's personal memories about the victory. It's reported to reach a maximum speed between 200 to 210 miles per hour. Sitting at number 5 is the McLaren Sabre, which costs $4.98 million. Only 15 customized units of McLaren Sabre were built specifically for US customers, so it didn't have to worry about meeting the rules for any other country. The McLaren Sabre is a variant of the McLaren Senna GTR, and the only difference is that the Sabre is designed to be a show car for the road. McLaren Sabre's head-turning looks are due to the unique carbon fiber exteriors that incorporate the Senna GTR's massive rear wing. This is McLaren's widest car that looks like a combination of the world's finest mechanical components. Its exhaust is made from the super alloy Inconel, which is also used on Formula One cars. The hydraulic steering is considered to be the best out there. The interior also showcases a number of custom touches like crowns embroidered in the seats and the uniquely blue tint to the carbon. The Sabre boasts a 4.0-liter twin-turbo V8 engine that delivers a spectacular 824 horsepower. This makes it the most powerful internal combustion engine McLaren has ever produced for a road car. Because of this, the car can hit a top speed of 218 miles per hour. Nabbing our fourth spot is the Pagani Huayra Tricolor. Having a price tag of $6.7 million, the Pagani Huayra Tricolor is a roadster built to celebrate the 60th anniversary of Italy's Fraca Tricolori, the Italian Air Force's aerobatics team. If you think that the 15 units of McLaren Sabre shouts exclusivity, you'd definitely be surprised to know that there were only three units built. Originally, Pagani was going to build just one of these extraordinary autos. Each unit is numbered 0, 1, and 10 to symbolize each member of the Freke Tricolori. The hypercar's design pays homage to the Air Maki MB339A PAN the aircraft used by the squadron. With this, the tricolor is jam-packed with stylistic and aerodynamics details. The car's rear wing supports are designed to resemble the tail fin of the iconic jet. It is also built with a regular wire carbon titanium monocoque and features a futuristic no-roof bodywork in blue carbon weave accented by Italian flag colors on the side. It also boasts a new and updated front splitter and rear diffuser and the front bumper funnels cool air straight to the engine. 
With a car using an AMG 6-liter twin-turbo B12 engine that produces 840 horsepower and can reach a top speed of 238 miles per hour. It is regarded as Pagani's most powerful car to date. Moving into our third spot, we have the Bugatti Cento DC, which costs $9.7 million. Bugatti is known to be one of the famous brands in the luxury car industry, so it's not surprising that we see their luxury cars in this ranking. The Cento DC pays homage to the Bugatti's EV110, which was released way back in 1991. Back then, the EB110 is considered the fastest and the most extraordinary supercar of its time. With Bugatti only building 10 units of the Cento GC, you can definitely say that it's a once-in-a-lifetime kind of car. Production is estimated to start this year, 2022. The Cento DC is based on Bugatti's flagship model, the Chiron Supercar, but it exudes the aura of the EB110. It features several modern interpretations of the EB110's remarkable styling cues. There are ultra-slim LED headlights that are featured at the front and long horizontal stripes are seen on both sides of the supercar. It also features redesigned wheels that look sleek and glossy. The blacked-out A-pillars create a visor-like look for the glass house, behind which cheese grater vents channel air to the motor that features a unique glass cover. At the back, a massive LED light arrangement makes up the taillight setup with a huge wing atop the rear. The Santo DC is powered by an 8-liter quad-turbo W16 engine that produces an immense power of 1,578 horsepower. The Bugatti Santo DC can also reach a maximum speed of 236 miles per hour. Our runner-up is another Bugatti car, the Bugatti La Vauture Noir which is priced at $18.7 million. The La Vauture Noir, or LVN, was built to celebrate Bugatti's 110-year anniversary. It also pays tribute to Jean Bugatti's most beautiful and famous design, the Type 57 SC Atlantic Coupe. La Vauture Noir directly translates to the black car. The car boasts a sophisticated design that differs from the brand's flagship supercar Chiron by losing the latter's big C-shapes on the sides. The Roadster's nose is different as well, as it is pointier in the LVN than in the Chiron. The black car is also a departure from the angry square eyes and it features more insectoid-like LEDs. LVN also has a central spine that runs nearly the entire length of the car, with a windshield wiper standing upright while it rests. The LVN is powered by an 8-liter quad-turbo 16-cylinder engine that produces 1,500 horsepower on each wheel. This power is subpar to that of the Cento DC, with its top speed is set to be at 260 miles per hour, which is way faster than the Cento DC. Bugatti announced that there will be just one unit of LVN to ever be built. Not long after the LVN was announced in 2019, the sole unit has quickly been purchased by an unnamed buyer for the highest new car price ever. But that record is now broken by our top spot holder, the Rolls-Royce Boat Tail, priced at $28 million. The Rolls-Royce Boat Tail now holds the record as the most expensive street legal car in the world. It is announced that only three units of the Rolls-Royce Boat Tail will be manufactured. The first one has already debuted its sleek ocean blue color in 2021. True to its name, the design has incredible proportions inspired by boat tail cars. The boat tail's hood has a gradient effect with a color fading into the rest of the body's hue as it reaches the windshield. The gradient on the hood was hand painted as well. Picnics have never been this easy as Rolls-Royce boat tail is the first car to have a built-in extended umbrella and a cocktail table. It is a four-seater luxury car that measures 19 feet. The roof of the Rolls-Royce boat tail is completely removable, and it features a glass rear window and two upright posts made from carbon fiber. The owner can simply press a button and the rear deck opens. The rear portion of the car automatically lifts up and opens up an umbrella. This car is best for people who love absolute luxury. There is a separate cooler for champagne inside the car to fit the owner's preferred bubbly drink. The Rolls-Royce Boat Tail has a 6.75-liter twin-turbo V12 engine and it can reach a maximum speed of 155 miles per hour. Those are the six most expensive cars that are steering somewhere in the world right now.
As records are made to be broken, we can expect to see a new car taking a spot on this list within the succeeding years. Are you expecting to see a particular car brand on this list? Let us know in the comments section below. This is Luxcove and we can't wait for you to see what indulgence awaits you on our next video.